Yeah, yeah, big storm coming, black rain coming First in the world, tell me who won it Winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep Big storm coming, black rain coming First in the world, tell me who won it Winning by 40, I ain't taking no knee I'm running up scores, I'm throwing it deep This is a this is a team that was very heavily favored, you know, when Madden first came out, you know. Very heavily favored team, you know, Todd Gurley really had ability, you know, um, then they got uh uh I'm having a brain fart. Then they got this dude right here, Jalen Ramsey, they got Jalen Ramsey, so everybody used them, you know. But you know, receivers the tricky part is my defense. You know, left end, I got Clay Matthews. Right end, I got Dante Fowler. And in the middle, I have Aaron Donald. You know, left linebacker, 68 overall, 85 speed, 79, 66, 83, 84 speed, and then 87 speed, 81 overall. Then my DBs, you know, Ramsey and Robbie, Robbie Coleman. And then, you know, I like speed there, so I got 63 overall, 91 speed. I took Eric Weddle out, 85 speed, just could not get the job done for me. And I got 58 overall, 91 speed, uh, 84, 85 speed, once again, just cannot get the job done for me. So, you know, I'm going to try the Rams, you know. I am definitely going to try the Rams. This is a team that most people don't use anymore, but hey, I'm going to give them a shot. In, so that is great. I'm glad I got you right there in that middle, Aaron Donald. I mean, that was a four yard run, but I'm glad I got you in that middle, Aaron Donald. Screen. Let's go. Lou John and Eastside Boys. <laughs> Lou John and the Punt. You don't come out and play like that to punt the ball. You don't. I'm sorry. You don't. I'm sorry, but when you play against me, you cannot play conservative like that. When you see that name, Black Rain Ford, pop up there on top of your screen, you got to play your very best game. As Todd really just gets wrapped up in the backfield. Strong safety. I really don't know what kind of defense to expect right here. I maybe could have uh, rat caught that, but you know, I went with the safe move. And then I went with the, when I rolled out, I stopped and sat up to throw it, because I don't know if his throw on the run. So right here, what I'm reading, I'm reading that cornerback. Either the cornerback's playing the flat or this outside linebacker's playing the flat. One of them's playing the flat. Right now, nobody's playing the flat. <laughs> what in the foolery? Like, wow. And that's the read right there. So that's the read, you know. Who's playing the flat? And how are they playing the flat? That's the read. That is all I'm reading. And sometimes, like, when the play is, like, low and I can't really see, like, the corner. If I can't see the corner out there, I read the safety. If the safety is getting wide right now, it's cover two. You know? If the safety is, like, staying, going straight back or going to the middle, it's cover three or cover four. But if I see that safety slow creeping back over top of the one receiver, I know that corner's most likely in a, in a flat or something, and 
I'm gonna make that throw, you know. So I'm always reading the safety or the, the corner before every play. In comes the stickiest back. And how are we gonna play this? Oh my. I don't like that defense I had for that. Okay, okay, okay. I like that. I like that. I just got to scoop. I just got to scoop, scoop. Scoop, 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 scoop. Okay. Okay. I'm dumb. <clears throat> click off, click on real quick, make the tap. 36 Wildcat again. Abukum. Abukum. I, I spread you out to set the edge. Setting the edge means nobody gets outside of you. So when that blocker comes to you, you put your arm here on him, have this arm free. So if anybody comes outside, you're shielding him off and gonna make the tackle. That is setting the edge. You did not set the edge right there. Cool. All right. Let me see. Is he gonna talk to that receiver right there to the right? Yep, I'm putting Jalen Ramsey in a hard flat. Oh my! <laughs> I guess. Come on, come on, stick. I guess so wrong. Like I guess so wrong. Oh my god! I put Jalen Ramsey in a hard flat. <laughs> Go back and watch that. Go back and watch that. He was screaming down the field. I know he's mad at Mitch Trubisky right now. He's mad. Okay. Cooks. Cooks should be open. Cooks should be open middle of the field. Look at this. Cooks should be open. Oh, God. I messed up. It's cover three. It's cover three. Definitely cover three. Uh, I was expecting cover two right there. You know, guess wrong again. Wildcat. Abuka. Set the edge, buddy. You see what I'm saying? You see what happens when you set the edge? When you're wider than everybody, he has to cut up inside. That's where all your help is, you know? You're the only person out there on the outside. Make everybody come inside of you. Let's go, man. These three people routes is not just gonna it's just not gonna get the job done. And the slowest juke move in the world goes to Cooper Cup! <laughs> Funny story, I played against Cooper Cup at uh he went to Eastern Washington. When I was at Youngstown State, I played against Cooper Cup, and he torched us. We ended up beating them to go to the national championship, but he torched us. I think he had uh, 10 catches for 200 yards at halftime. As I deliver a dot. That's a dot. That is a... Did I not score? Oh, why didn't the touchdown banner go across the screen? What did they do? Hey, hey, now, don't be trying to cheat me now. Don't be trying to cheat me now. Ooh, oh my guy's scared. You know, as you guys can see, I can do this with any and every team, you know? And then people asking me, you know, why don't you play with these random teams versus the very best guys you play? You know, like, if I play, like, an unranked game, you know, if I play with an unranked game, I'm going to play with my very best team, you know, because you're going to come with your very best team. Like, what sense would it be for me to try to prove a point playing, like, knowing that I'm playing one of the very best guys with a random team? You know, I, I do random teams versus ranked games because I have no clue who my opponent is. If I happen to run into somebody good, then I'll play, you know. I, I don't mind playing, you know, but... 
if I get a chance to like, if I'm, if I know I'm playing the very best guy, I'm gonna, <laughs> you're gonna get my best. Oh, TG, TG, TG. I'm gonna run it, but that right there wasn't a run for me. You're gonna run commit right here for sure. <laughs> it's all about the mind games, man. It's all about the mind games. Like third and five, you're like, okay, you know, he has a chance of throwing it. Like he might throw it on fourth and five. I'm mean, on third and five, you know. So I'm not gonna run commit, you know, because first and ten comes. Okay, he definitely running the ball. He's 100% running the ball on first and 10. Yeah. I'm thinking how you're thinking. Like, we're thinking the same thing. Literally thinking the same thing. So, I'm going to do the opposite. Set the edge. Wide is the widest. Set the edge. All you got to do is set the edge. You have inside help. I promise. Abuku. Set the edge. You have help on the inside, just set the edge, buddy, I promise. You know, we're still preaching, you know, setting the edge. No edge set. No edge set, no no good run defense, you know. No edge set. Boom, the edge is set. The edge is set. The edge is set. <laughs> set the edge. Set the... Oh, they cheated me. And they cheated me. I just slipped right past him like that. Come on. That was great run, D. Set the edge. Set the edge. Set the... I know y'all tired of hearing me say this, but man. This is what I'm thinking in my mind every time. Set the edge. I was not inside help. <sighs> I was not inside help for you right there. You know. We stopped it, you know, eight times out of ten. You know, I can't. It, it, it's mad, you know. It's gonna happen. Eventually, he's gonna break along. Nice run. Nice run. Nice run. Nice run. This is a GG, you know. This right here is a GG. You know, all I really got out of this, you know, I'm taking this is a lesson for me. I'm learning how to box the run, the the wildcat run. You know, I think I got it figured out. You know, I stopped it. You know, the majority of the times, but you know, it's, it all really comes down to my positioning and my one on one tackle. It's really, it's really what it all comes down to. So if guys want to know how to stop the the goal line, I mean the the wildcat run, I'm gonna show you my adjustments. I'm running Storm Brave one, close the line, spread linebackers, blitz all linebackers, blitz all linebackers, and this is what it looks like. If I had somebody to set the freaking edge, I gotta scoot that guy out too a little bit to help to make him. Okay, here we go. Like, set the edge, dude. What are you doing? Like, come, you see what happens when we set the edge? He got to turn it up. You know, and most likely we're going to have people there. I don't know what this is. Drag, drag. I'm here. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Somebody take my control away from me. Here, just take it. Just have it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just have it. Because that right there was just nasty. Yeah, people want me to uh, make the videos funner. You know, I'm not here to be fun or entertaining. If you find me fun and entertaining, cool. But I'm here to teach. I'm here to, you know, show you real football 
and how to manipulate this game. It's all about manipulating the game. You know, this game has some bad things about it and you gotta turn the bad things to good. If you can't adapt to the game, you will not be good at the game. 17th Street. Check my boy Farm out on a 34. Ooh, You did. But, but yeah, thank you guys for watching the video. Catch you next time. Peace. Hey, hey, hey.